What's going on YouTube? DJK coming at you with a quick video. I'll be making a few vids with this computer, but I wanted to just show you guys what I really like about my MacBook is the HDMI port on this bitch. <laughs> Cause now you can actually hook your MacBook Pro up to any L C D TV, basically. And you can pretty much uh have your content on your, your TV. As you can see, um, this is a screen right here. I don't really have nothing up on here, but I'm just showing you guys the one of the coolest features of this computer to me is the fact that you can. I got a, a 10 foot uh, HDMI card I bought off Amazon just so I can see if it would work, and it did. So here it is on the 46 inch Google TV. You got the Mac computer displaying right on there. I was trying to find like a, you know, like Google Chrome or something. Let's go to the Mac uh, website just to show you guys here. Look how big that shit is. <laughs> it's freaking huge, man. Let's expand it out. I think I can. Look at that. Now, of course, the Sony Google TV is an internet TV. So, of course, having this computer defeats the purpose of having a Sony Google TV because basically you got an internet TV with your laptop because <laughs> all you, you can run Hulu Hulu on here too now on the Sony Google TV Hulu actually um, blocked the Sony Google TV from working like it won't you can't pull up Hulu on this if you go to the Google Chrome browser on this television it will not allow you to watch uh tv shows and it won't allow, it won't let you watch nothing on the site they got it blocked on the google tv for some strange reason of course you all know the google tv was a pretty much a flop it didn't really do well uh a lot of people didn't buy it uh it's a nice tv though it's a real nice tv but it was a pricey tv when it came out it was 1300 bucks and people weren't trying to spend 1300 dollars on this tv a lot of big time youtube partners got this tv for free but of course i was not one of them I uh, purchased this TV with my own hard-earned money, and because I liked the TV, I didn't. I, I just liked it. I thought it was a pretty cool TV, so that's the reason I got it. But um, yeah, that's what I really like about this computer. You can actually, I, I'm gonna pull up a uh, tractor just to let you guys see tractor on here, real fast. Even though I don't have the the uh, S4 connected to it right now. Now I did run the S4 on here. And let me tell you guys, the uh, the USB port is not, it, ha it has several errors coming from the USB port. So it was, it, the, the audio was real, real choppy. It sounded like crap. So either, only only way I could use this laptop with uh, the, the tractor control S4 is using a, a audio interface other than the S4's interface or oh, they got to update the driver to work with this new macbook so native instruments if you see this video um even though this is just a this this computer this computer just came out so you got to give them time they may come out with a uh with a, a firmware update because that's the problem the firmware is not w compatible with this computer from what i experienced i tried both usb ports and it's popping and cracking and everything so the only way I was able to make it work is I plugged it up to my USB, Alesis USB Multi Mix 8 mixer, and I was able to select that as my sound card, and it worked fine. But other than that, uh, you can't really use the Tractor Control S4s as a sound card with this computer, with this new MacBook Pro. It does not work because the firmware is jacked the hell up or something. It's, <laughs> it's snack crackling and popping. So, Native Instruments, if you see this video, Hope you your engineers get on this problem, this issue to get this uh, resolved with the S4's firmware because it's definitely not working from what I just experienced. Um, but other than that, it does. The software runs great, machine works fine, but only the S4's firmware is just not compatible with the new. Maybe it's the USB ports. It got to be the USB ports because the software comes up and works fine. So I'm thinking it's the USB 3.0 port ports it's a ports issue i guess i don't know but like i said it ain't working right so but other than that i just want to show you guys that the sony google tv running the macbook pro looks looking pretty cool looking pretty freaking nice i must say myself 
I'm uh, amazed at the look, at the quality. <laughs> but anyway, with that being said, I'll see you guys on the next video. DJK is out for now.